This is a new phenomena which we are going to see, which is called as mobility degradation. Now we have just seen that E lateral was given by VDS by L. Similarly, E vertical was given by VGS by TOX. Now what's happening here is, as we go on increasing our VGS, let's say if you are increasing our VGS, what's happening in the cross-sectional view of a transistor is very simple. There will be more number of electrons which will be attracted and the channel is formed once it crosses the threshold voltage and this is what's going to happen. Now when these electrons were moving freely in the substrate, there was no problem. But now because of this positive voltage increasing on VGS, more number of electrons are attracted towards the channel and hence when they are getting attracted towards the channel, also because the E vertical is increasing, as VGS is increasing, E vertical is increasing, more number of electrons are attracted towards the channel or towards the surface of my substrate. So what's going to happen is this electrons initially had a lot of free space to move, but right now all of them have come in a very limited area or limited space and electrons would repel other electrons and they would get scattered. And because they have less space to move, we also understand and also because in the very little space they will collide not with other electrons but collisions will take place of these electrons with other carriers and because of which their mobility will be degraded. So in very simple language if I have to put how the mobility is degraded it's nothing but mu n mobility of electrons equal to mu n o we will see what is this upon 1 plus eta times VGS minus VTN where mu n is nothing but mobility of my electrons when VGS is normal mu n o is nothing but mobility of my electrons when VGS is increasing constantly and when VGS is increasing constantly and as we mentioned that more number of electrons would be accommodated under the surface of the substrate near the channel it will lead to scattering and collision of these carriers which will lead to its degradation of mobility so this mu n o is nothing but the mobility which is reduced due to or i would say mu n o is nothing but the mobility due to vgs taking a higher value eta is an empirical factor which is constant vgs minus vtn so this is another phenomena called as mobility degradation hope you have understood stay tuned for further clips thank you